What if I told you the most popular catchphrase from Mass Effect is never said in the games? We'll bang, okay? In this video, we're going to explore how a meme channel revolutionized Mass Effect fan culture forever. In order to fully understand the story, we need to go back to Mass Effect 3. 2012. Bioware releases the third and final installment of the original Mass Effect trilogy. Their parent company, Electronic Arts, was looking for ways to expand the fan base of Mass Effect to compete with other popular shooters of the time, such as Gears of War 3 and Call of Duty. Enter Jessica Chobit, popular host of IGN's The Daily Fix. Bioware and EA hired Chobit to play a reporter named Diana Allers, perhaps in an attempt to create more mass appeal for Mass Effect 3. The reception of this character has been mixed among the fandom to say the least. Every time I play Mass Effect 3, whenever I see Diana Allers on the Citadel, the first thing I think is, I'm a reporter for the show called Battle Tits. I can never view this conversation again after the memes. On March 24th, 2012, the YouTube channel Manslayer posted a video called Gamer Poop Mass Effect 3. The original video, which has since been privated, featured heavily edited audio to make the characters say ridiculous, funny, and very spicy things. The council put me in lockdown to keep the women off me. Didn't want problems, but the situation changed. What? I'm Commander Shepard, Alliance Drag Queen. It was lowbrow internet humor, which spread throughout the community like wildfire, with numerous memes and forum posts being shared amongst the fandom. This conversation between Shepard and Diana Allers is the first time we hear the now famous phrase. We're bang, okay? This catchphrase is frequently used in Manslayer's many Mass Effect meme videos. I just wanted to bang you. I'll come by when you're feeling better. We're bang, okay? We're bang, okay? Oh. Still impatient, Commander? I care about you, Ash. Miranda, damn it! The funniest thing about this to me is that some fans ask Commander Shepard's voice actor, Mark Mir, to say this when they see him in public. Sam, this is Commander Shepard. Report to the Normandy as soon as possible. We'll bang, okay? Dr. Chakwas is one of the OG Mass Effect characters, one of the few who sticks with Commander Shepard in all three games. She's also affectionately referred to as Dr. Chocolates because of the meme videos. Dr. Chocolates, what do you think about Cerberus? We took their money, took their best fish, took their best chips. I'm used to taking it from the back. A very respectable position. What? So, I heard you siding with reapers to abduct women. <laughs> you old cunt. That makes no sense. Morden's quest to cure the genophage is one of the best character arcs in Mass Effect 3. The final conversation with Morden at the Shroud is particularly emotional if you try to convince him to leave before dispersing the cure. Every time we've talked about this before, you've defended the genophage. Hell, you destroyed Malin's data. How can you change your mind now? I made a mistake! I made a mistake. Focused on big picture. Big picture made of little pictures. Too many variables. But as powerful as this scene is, of course, it hasn't been left untouched by Manslayer. I made a mistake! Nice. I f***ing love steak. My main man, Joker, also ended up in the crosshairs. What's new, Edie? I kissed Joker. Edie. But when I removed his jeans... Enough, Edie. I don't want to hear it. I detected a very short anomaly. Oh, that's nasty. And? I am not easily repulsed, but his size was very limited, and just like that. The magic is gone. The Catalyst, aka the Star Child, was one of the most hated characters in Mass Effect 3. It became synonymous with the disappointment many players felt over the game's endings. Manslayer was also able to poke fun at this, combining the Catalyst conversation with a meme about Javik. I wasn't going to ask, but... Catalyst, how does one last long in bed? No, no you can't. Why? I stopped that from happening. What? Bullshit. You won't last. I created the Reapers, so that never happens. You son of a bitch. Commander, throw it out the airlock. No, don't. One of my favorite Manslayer videos is the one where Shepard and Caden have a heart-to-heart. -heart. It'd be nice to have someone to turn to when things get grim. Someone to live for. Maybe love. I don't really have to look far. Shepard. Really? My mom is, um, pretty damn odd. Oh. Okay. You know, when this war is over, I think I'll take her. Dancing in the streets, hugging and f***ing. Hell yeah. 
I think what made these videos so successful is that they were just short and funny. This made them infinitely shareable, quotable, and rewatchable. Plus, the viewer is incapable of seeing the original scenes the same way without thinking about the edited version. We can't talk about this. If word gets out that I got too close to a source... I'll make sure this stays just between us. Thanks, Commander. I'm kidding. I'll go tell the galaxy what we've done. Ugh. They could use some good news. It's just great content. Manslayer still posts on his YouTube channel, but today the uploads are few and far between. But regardless of whether he continues to post new videos or not, his Mass Effect compilations will forever live on in the community. So there you have it, how a meme channel changed Mass Effect forever. If you like this video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to Big Dan Gaming. Big shout out to all the channel members for supporting my content. Until next time, this has been Big Dan. I should go.